All right. All right. Just stick to the plan. It's a good plan. If everything works out, I'll be all set to start spending lots of more time with... What are you just standing there for, you creep? Don't sneak up behind people like that. Gosh, it's super weird. I... Okay, well, you should have spoken up because I couldn't hear you. It's no wonder I'm the only one in this school that ever talks to you. Nobody wants to put up with your mumbling. Uh, so what? And I wasn't whispering to you. I was whispering to myself. You weren't supposed to be able to hear me. Uh, you weren't able to hear what I was saying, right? Oh, good. Good. Well, what were you trying to say anyway? Hurry it up. I don't have all day. The cake? Yeah, sure, whatever. It's not like I was doing you a special favor or anything. I was full. And you were still looking hungry after lunch, so I gave it to you. I just don't like to waste food is all. Uh, but, you know, just out of curiosity, did you like it? Yeah, I made it myself. I just, um, I, I like to cook. It's not like I had to make five different cakes just to get it right. And even if I did, I didn't do it for you. I didn't think about you at all while I was baking that cake. Not once. Ugh, you're stressing me out. Oh, I need to tap something to calm myself down. just something I do when I'm nervous or annoyed. You're bugging me, that's all. Yeah, you do that. Bye. Oh, shoot, the plan. Uh, wait, there was something I needed to tell you. Well, uh, Mr. Jennings wanted me to tell you that he's switching around partners for that project he told us about today. Uh, well, obviously, I'm telling you because I'm your new partner. Duh. I'm not exactly thrilled about it, but it is what it is. I guess it's not all bad, though. You're weirdly good at this sort of thing, from what I hear. I guess you have to be good at something. So, uh, how do you want to do this? The project, I mean. Um, do you want to meet up later, or... Uh, yeah, I know there's time to do it in class, but oh, I already see you in class anymore. I just want to put some more effort into this project. I need the extra credit, you see. You're just going to have to deal with it. Hmm? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's why he switched us around, because you're good in this class. What? No! No, obviously. I didn't ask for you, specifically. I'd never ask to be paired up with you. You're weird. Plus, it'd be, like, such a pain, because then I'd have to ask him not to tell you that I asked to be your partner, and then I'd have to promise that I wasn't actually doing it to bully you, and then I'd have to plead and beg for him for, like, 20 minutes. I don't know why he was so stubborn about... <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I, I definitely didn't do that. I, um... Yeah, don't worry about it. I'm just annoyed, again, for no particular reason. Anyway, about the subject, you can go ahead and pick. Yeah, just whatever you want. You can have whatever you want with the project. I just, uh, you know this stuff better than I do, so, you know, I'll trust you. But you'd better get me extra credit. We should probably meet, like, often for the project. I'm not good at this stuff, but I'm not going to slack off and make you do it. We should, like, meet often. Hmm, yeah. Oh, you know, at, at like my house or or yours, or we could study at like a restaurant. Mhm, mm just just for some food too, and and we could we could eat together. 
But uh, only because I can't think on an empty stomach. Otherwise, I'd never want to go somewhere public with you. It'd feel too much like a date. Oh, this coffee can isn't doing it. I need to tap on something better. Uh, g give me that textbook. Just give it. That's better. Uh, yeah, annoyed again. You have that effect on me. So, yeah, restaurant. Probably just a fast food place, something chill. That's what I was thinking. Not, not that I was thinking about going out to eat with you. That's the last thing I ever want to think about. We could even, like, see a movie or something afterwards. I, I don't know, you know, just to decompress. You have to relax after you work hard. Just sort of makes sense for us to go together if we've been seen working together. And there's that one movie that's coming out tomorrow. You know, you know the one with the, um, the really raunchy superhero and the, the weird wolf guy? Yeah, that one. I know you like that stuff. I, I mean, I, I bet you like that stuff. And just because it would be so stereotypical for someone like you. So we could see that one. <laughs> no, yeah, that does sort of sound like a date, stupid. Yeah, maybe, maybe we shouldn't. Yeah, okay. We, um... I mean, whatever. If, if you still really want to, I, I guess that's fine, but... What do you mean? Don't get any ideas. I mean, you were the one that said it sounded like a date. I'm just trying to get this assignment done right. There's no way I'd want to do anything even remotely like a date with you. I just want a good grade. It's all for my grade. Got it? Yeah, well, so what? I don't care what you think. You can have your weird little fantasy and pretend it's a date if you really want to. It's pretty sad, though, that you need to pretend study sessions or dates. Oh, you must be super lonely. I... Okay, okay, sorry. Yeah, that was... That was sort of harsh. I... I just... I get really weird when you're around. I don't know. You bring out the worst in me. I usually don't care what people think of me, but you... God, don't look at me like that. Ugh, I bet you think I like you or something. Well, I don't. I don't like anyone, in fact. I'm too focused on other things to worry about than crushes, so don't get all smug and think I've fallen for you or anything like that. You're just... You're just throwing me off. That's all. <sighs> Moving on. We're gonna need to be in contact with each other. You know, for the project. Actually, you should probably give me your address, too. I know I said we'd meet at a restaurant, but, well, maybe I need to drop by for something. I mean, obviously I'll text before I come, but I'd really like to have it for convenience's sake. Mine? Why would you eat? I mean, yes. Yeah, sure. Fine. I guess it's only fair. Uh, you can drop by any time, though. You don't even have to text. Wait, no, no, do text. I don't think I could handle it if you showed up at my doorstep unannounced. Uh, just, you know, I, I need to mentally prepare myself for you, you know, because you're kind of annoying, but it's fine for you to come as, you know, as long as you give me a heads up, uh, even if it's not related to the project. Yeah, yeah, like, you know, you bug me, but better than being bored, I guess. You're interesting in a really weird way. You don't act like everyone else, even when I get snappy or rude or... You still keep acting so nice. Nobody's done that for me before. It's hard, because that's just 
It's how I act when I get really nervous. I, I mean, oh, so oh, maybe we can meet him tomorrow. I can't today. I am way too exhausted after pulling off this whole plan. I th never mind. Just tomorrow, okay? I'll text you the time and place and um, yes for the movie after. Oh no, don't worry. I'll pay. You don't need to worry about a budget. Yeah, no, um, it's, uh, I just, I sort of feel obligated since, you know, I'm the one calling all the shots, you know? What? Oh, so you think I'm nice now, huh? I'm not nice, I'm just not a jerk. You better watch your mouth or I'm slipping hot sauce into your drink tomorrow. Anyway, we'll talk more later. I'm gonna get out of here before you drive me up the wall with all your dumb comments. Bye. person in the school that you like, and they're the one person who's still nice to you. God, don't mess it up. Oh, we're gonna get so much closer, and I'll ask a bunch of good questions, and I'll finally work up the nerve to say, are you watching me? Get out of here, go! Goodbye, and um, text me if you want. Okay, bye!